<laughs> Meet Bicycle! Hello everybody! Welcome back to Borderlands, the pre-sequel. Today I've got another weapon chest location guide for you guys and we're going to be covering all the chests in Outlands Canyon. So, number one is uh, part of the X marks the spots mission where you've got to blow the X up with dynamite and uh, again you'll come into this room where Rabid Adams will spawn just there and his little pet talk and uh, just from the right hand side of that is your first chest it's a small door chest on the right hand side right near the door where Rabid, Rabid Adams will come out so there it is on the map for you guys next we are just uh, pretty close to where the fast travel is really and uh, you should all know this by now but that room up there is uh, operated by a force field which uh, will have some jump pads in it. Where I'm marking now on the map is the, where the three jump pads are. I'm not going to go through all three jump pads, but uh, I'll hit the last one just for you guys. And uh, there it is. And uh, if you want to see how, how to open that, where the three jump pads are, just go to my Badass Rank guides and it's actually a Badass Rank challenge. But just before we actually go into that room, after we've operated all three jump pads, there is a little loot toilet just here. Uh, so open that up and get yourself a few weapons or shields. And uh, then next we're going to go into the actual building, the force field obviously is down now and in here you've got a moon chest right in front of you as you come in. It's the only thing in this room so uh, it's pretty easy to find. There it is on the map once again. And then from there we're going to actually come out and then head back towards where the fast travel is uh, which is just on the left hand side up there. And uh, in this middle building on the left hand side as you're running down uh, is your next chest which is right at the back on the left hand side and it's a small dial chest once again so there is the map reference for it next we are pretty much towards the left hand side of the map this is the area where you first come in from Triton Flats and you uh, jump along all these cliffs uh, right in front of me but uh, just in this cliff here on the left hand side as you're coming in there is another dial chest on a separate cliff so uh, there it is a small dog chest once again and there it is on the map next we are further up towards the near where you go to the um, the shock slaughter dome whatever it is and um, that kind of area it's quite a big little town with a load of shacks and that and uh, this mission is a badass rank challenge as well where you've got to climb the tower but uh, there we go I've sped it up for you guys uh, be a pretty easy way to get up the tower if you don't know how to get up just follow what I did uh, but right at the top is a moon chest waiting for you again right at the top so uh, there it is on the map, and that is towards the right hand side of the map, if you don't know where that is, you'll see the big structure on the mini map. From there we're going to jump down to the right as well and head towards the edge of the map here, and uh, just there as you can see there is a uh, dial chest set up on that cliff, so we'll just go ahead and jump to that now. And there it is, so it's uh, another small dial chest once again. And once again I'll bring that up on the map for you. And uh, I could have run to the next one, but uh, I didn't see it at the time, but we'll just cut to it now. Basically, that's where we just was with the uh, chest, and uh, just here, it's near the pool where you find the, uh, the map originally. And on the right hand side of these loop toilets, one of them will open up and uh, let you have it. So there it is on the map. And just for reference, it's just around the corner from that basketball mission, which is uh, just where I was looking then. Next, we are pretty much on top of where we just was. Um, but you've got to run around, climb that big structure and run along and finally get to this. But uh, if you enter this building here, run right to the end and turn right. There is a moon chest waiting for you in this little side room here. There's the map reference once again. And then the final chest in this map is right towards the right um, left hand side of the map as you can see. And uh, it's part of the side mission where you've got to go hunting threshers for hammerlock and freeze the baby ones if you remember that one and in this area down at the bottom of the cave right near the uh, lava is your final chest and it's a small door chest so uh, it's in its own little section as you can see on the map pretty easy to uh, navigate this one and uh, yeah that's it so uh, that is it guys that is weapon chest location guide on Outlands Canyon I hope there's some in there that you didn't know about and uh, have actually helped you out there. If there are any that I've missed that you know about, please feel free to put it in the comments and tell me. And uh, if I discover it, I will put it in a re edited video and uh, give you a good bit of a shout out for it. But yeah, let me know if there's any that I've missed. But for now, that's Weapon Chest Location Guide in Outlands Canyon. Thanks for watching everyone and I will see you in the next video.